what's worse, a fucking gym buddy who is never on time or a gym buddy who gets enraged when you're not on time? <laughs> I don't know, but we're going to put in some work today and it'll be fun and I'm very excited to spend some time with an old friend to do something fun. Peace. Fucking dripping. Insanity. I'm drenched. Look, I don't know if you can see. That's all I got left on this shirt. Fucking floor is all wet. And now we're running on the treadmill, as Ronnie just explained, and we're fucking hitting this hard. Now it's Tyler's turn. We're doing this so all of us quit, basically. All right, you're next, bro. It's time to do this. Five seconds, right? And when you get to 25, so you don't hurt yourself, you jump off like this. Fast as you can, 25 seconds. 25 seconds and then the intervals of, of three of us. How many it, times? It never stops. As many times until someone gives up. Ready? Okay. I just now officially became a member of the Mickey Mouse Club, so now they're gonna let me go do the real workout. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Robert likes this to say that this shit's easy, but uh, well, check Robert's it's, shirt out. It's anything but, dude. Look at this shit. We're not even done. I don't even have a dry spot anymore. I think I got one right here. So this was a, it's a good workout before the real workout. We're gonna ride a bike. How many miles, dude? Like 20? Fucking 20 miles all uphill both ways. And um, 10 miles uphill, 10 miles down there. That's no joke, dude. Um, so we're fucking working. Time to get some food in our bellies. Wait till you fuel back up. Hey. Get that run going. Yeah. Wait till you get to mile five, bro. Oh my god. Oh my god. You know, here's the here's the thing is I felt I felt good. I felt good. Doing the insanity, I'm like, wow, I'm in better shape. I can actually fucking get through this now. And then all of a sudden, it's like, dude, just wait till we get on that bike. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Good shit, though. So this is phase three of Radke's fitness and boot camp. Oh, I told you, you can't escape your fate, bro. You so, can't escape your fucking fate. So Ronnie's planned this whole thing out for about eight years. He thought about it the whole time he was locked up. And he's, he, we, we became friends again. Now he's gonna ride me out into the desert. We're gonna ride about fucking 10 miles right now. Maybe 20, something like that. So, this would be a gnarly ride. I haven't rode a bike in a while, so. This should be fun though. I'm very excited about it. Tyler's along for the ride as well. Keep you updated. Stoked. Working out, 
feeling good. You know, hanging out with friends, it's pretty awesome. So right now we're, we're stopping at Starbucks. They're fueling up right now again. What, some shots of espresso? Uh, take straight shots of espresso. Straight. To the dome. They're basically taking drugs, except except this is gonna be good for their lives. And um, no, you don't have to. You don't have to like be afraid you're gonna be offensive. We're taking drugs right now. <laughs> um, we see we got so good at it though. We we put them in sweet and low packets so no one could tell. <laughs> no, just kidding. There's some dangerous moments where it feels like. It feels like we're we're gonna you know get hit by cars and I'm not used to this bike but it's fun and you feel the wind blowing and it's fucking awesome having a good time and uh, yeah about a quarter of the way through it's gonna be awesome. A picture. We made it all the way to the edge of fucking Vegas, dude. From downtown, basically. 17 miles, 900 calories burned one way. And we, we this is it. There's no more Las Vegas. And the even better better thing is is we did two rounds of cardio before this. That's what you guys don't see. That's absolutely right. So about 2,500 calories, active, burnt. Done. Very proud of that. You should be too, Robert. And Tyler doesn't even fucking look tired. He's, he's just getting started. Now, here's the tricky part. We got to go all the way the fuck back. And it's not... And it actually also goes uphill. Last time you see me like this was either on stage or on a bunch of heroin. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm on both right now. Yeah. Woo! So, so this is it, dude. Now time to ride back, and this, this is fucking. This is ridiculous, actually. We've been working out for like six hours. <laughs> literally, literally, actually, it's time. You this is crazy. We'll this. go. You told me that my fucking workout program is like a Mickey Mouse training club or whatever. The, what do you feel about it now? I feel like this is. Uh, I feel like if it was the the little Mario when you start on on fucking when you're playing Mario and we just. This workout is 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 no. the big Mario after he ate a mushroom and got a fireball thing. No, no, no. This is no. You got it reversed. I know okay. what you mean. This is the Mario. You start out with a mushroom, thinking everything is going to be good, so that angry ass sun comes out with the glasses and swoops down and hits you, and makes you small. And it goes, <laughs> it's just, and you got to go into a couple good. tunnels for a second, get some coins, and you come back and you can finish the level. <laughs> so this is basically. Not a fucking Mickey Mouse workout. This is not no fucking Hello Kitty Fairy Princess shit. This is the real deal, dude. We just did a fucking triathlon marathon bullshit. And, you know and now, and we're not done. You know what the crazy thing is, Robert? This is your first day with me. Me and Tyler, we do this every single day. <laughs> and this is what they don't know. When we get back, I'm going to drive home and lift weights, too. I'm trying to get that I fucking no, dare you. <laughs> okay. I fucking... Oh, if, if you, you were lifted. Shit, <laughs> if you did some shit like that... Man. That would just be mentally unhealthy. All right, time to fucking roll all the way back. <laughs> Yo, Ronnie, can I leave my car here? Huh? Can you leave my car here? Can you leave your car here? Yeah, I'll pick it up tomorrow. I don't care. All right, cool. See you guys. Yeah, fucking right. <laughs> just, <laughs> just start riding home. We did it. I fucking believe you. 31 miles... 31 miles, finished it. I'm absolutely dead. Um, truthfully, I knew it would be tough. I didn't think it would be that tough. This was pretty insane. I fucking love this shit, dude. That was, that was amazing. The good shit, Tyler. Any last fucking words? Let's do it again tomorrow, Mark. We, 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 rode, we rode 31 miles, but before that we, um, we, we did in, the Insanity Challenge, and if you guys don't know what that is, it's high intensity interval training, which it's burst of energy, and it's constantly going. That, that took about, that's like about an hour and 10 minutes, burned about 500 calories doing that, and then, then we ran on the treadmill, and then we ran on the treadmill and burned about two or three hundred calories there, so that's a good amount of calories. And then, then we rode 31 miles on a bike. So, so I don't know why we did that, but uh, we oh because you talk so much shit all the time. <laughs> it's because he talks shit, saying that he can do anything. This is, this is the easiest workout I'm ever gonna do. It turns out, fuck that was the hardest I've ever done. Was that the hardest? Admittingly, that that's. Was that was the hardest I've ever done too. Just because that, what, what happens with that type of workout is it, it, 
anything is mental because you got to move weight or eat something heavier or whatever the case may be. Right. But this one is just like you, rigorous. You can't stop, and it's hours and hours. You know. Calories. Three hours and, thir and twenty-two minutes of of riding the bike. Just destroying our bodies and our minds. So. See you later. That's it. That was a fun time. Now it's fucking time to eat. We we'll see you. So now. We're gonna have some afterthoughts on this whole thing. Make amends with with people that we've, you know, had our falling outs with. Make amends and, and move forward and go beyond talking about the good old days and actually make new memories. And today was awesome. It was awesome that yeah, we we shared some some laughs looking back on our past and stuff and talked about the challenges we faced and it was cool. But overall today will be about five years from now we'll be like dude remember that time we rode fucking 30 miles together what the fuck were we thinking that was crazy but we did it you know this today was a new memory this was a new fun time this was not about you know anything else it was it was about fucking just being today and being in the moment so wonderful time dude kicked ass that was no mickey mouse workout that was crazy until next time